Number 66, engineering application. A device called an insulation meter is used to measure intensity of sunlight and has an area of 100 centimeters square and registers 600, uh, excuse me, 6.5 watts. What is the intensity in watts per meter squared? All right, so this is fairly straightforward, right? We know intensity is going to be equal to the power uh, supplied by a wave uh, divided by the area over which that power is applied. So the intensity will then be equal to the power. They told us that the uh, insulation meter is measuring a power of 6.50 watts. You have to know, then you got to memorize this, these units. Whenever you see a watt, you have to know that that means power, all right? Um, and then divide that now by the area over which that power is applied. And they told us the area, but what did they tell us? They told us, oh, wonderful, squared centimeters. We need it in squared meters, right? So what we simply have to do here, we can do the conversion on the side, 100 centimeters squared times then centimeter on the bond, bottom, meter on the top. One meter is 100 centimeters. That's 1,000. And we have to square that result, right? So it's basically 100 divided by 100 squared, or basically 1 over 100 then, and that's going to be equal to 0 0.01. And now all you have to do is just calculate, right? So this is just going to be multiplied by basically 100. So this is going to be 650 watts per meter square. There you go. Guys, thanks for tuning in. Hope this helps. Please remember to help us out and subscribe, and we will... See you soon, I guess. Yeah, sure. Or talk to you soon. Or just see in a video. Or, well, I won't see you. I'll just talk to you. All right. Anyway, enough of that. Take care.